progression of our label, we, you know, we are pretty new, so we started out with our 2005 Merlot, and my husband said, we gotta do, we gotta come up with a wine label, we gotta come up with a wine label, and so I used to be a graphic artist in my previous life, but um, I was trying to come up with an idea, and Monty, who's actually on this first label, my running partner, gave me the idea by picking grapes and throwing them around while we were out for our run, so I came back and I sketched it and we turned it in and got some help with another graphic artist and uh, came up with our, our label. A lot of people really liked it, um, it's a little whimsical, so this last bottling we just did, we decided we would grow up a little bit and get more refined and, and even change our name because people always wanted to know what VMV stands for. And then also, when we would go into an event, I'd say, I'm Carrie with VMV Winery, and they'd say, DMV has a winery? So we just got kind of tired of that whole thing, so we decided to be, just refine our label a little bit more. We, we wanted to keep the dog on it, so we kind of bounced some names around and decided to do a name blending, which is very popular in LA and uh, take our names and blend them together. So it came up with Vic, Carey, and Monty for the Carmont. And we put uh, Monty in a more, more prestigious look, running through the vineyard with the grapes. And uh, that's what we're going with. So we're pretty excited about it. Uh, just starting off in the last couple of weeks, we've been pouring it. People seem to be very receptive, so we're very excited to go forward with our new lead.